गुड इवनिंग गाइस दिस इज शांकला वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो टुडे टॉपिक इज चाइना प्लस 1 व्हाट इज चाइना प्लस 1 मोस्ट ऑफ द मल्टीनेशनल कंपनीज नाउ अ डेज दे आर एक्सप्लोरिंग दिस चाइना प्लस 1 पॉलिसी इन ऑर्डर टू रिड्यूस देयर डिपेंडेंसी ऑन चाइना व्हाई इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट व्हाट इज चाइना प्लस 1 वी विल ऑल टॉक अबाउट इन दिस वीडियो टू रिड्यूस देयर डिपेंडेंसी ऑन चाइना टू डाइवर्सिफाई देयर बिजनेस this creates a golden opportunity for countries like india to enhance their business to develop a good trade between other countries with big mncs and overall it will help the financial condition of the country india so first we will talk about what is china plus one various companies big mncs they are they want to diversify their business they don't want to solely dependent on one country like china i know china is having all the resources they have the talent they have you know manufacturing hub etc etc but still because of the over dependency on china this can lead to various havoc like supply chain issues because of that expenses are high and various other things which makes it more unpredictable and more you no know, are difficult for other countries to only depend on china if something happened if something wrong happened then whole supply chain can be disrupted whole production whole you no know, trade off will be hampered so this is the reason why china plus one policy is getting into action many companies many countries they don't want to rely on china because china is an unpredictable market yeah it is cheap it is convenient but you never know if you if you are put all the eggs in one basket then if that basket falls all the eggs are broken so basically it is a business strategy to diversify their business operation not only in china but also in different countries so that they will get a proper return so that their production their supply chain would be smooth if something happened if some instability occurs in china as we all know covid is at the door so many many people are dying various cases are coming so because of that the supply chain the production the economy of the china is at the lowest point and in this case if a company is solely dependent on china let's say apple or samsung whatever then they have to face the consequences so that is the reason what are the consequences they the production is delayed the supply chain is hampered and rest other things and cost of the production increases the uh, customers are not getting products on time so these are the challenges so that's why companies are now smarter they want to you know diversify their portfolio in different different companies different different countries so that if something happened in one line other lines are green that is the reason why the the second question is why companies are adopting china plus one why why there is a need first reason is geopolitical tensions in china is always there because of china china is having war with the west and because of that there may arise any political instability or economic instability in china uh, second thing is a decrease in the dependencies as i told you no one wants to put all the eggs in one basket because of this reason Uh, the companies want to diversify it and because of that they feel more secure more safer uh and more assured about their products that they deliver to the customer okay over dependency should lead to disruption of supply chain if all the companies major companies top mncs of the world they are focusing on production in china then something happened too much risk involved you know billions and billions of turns are manufactured in china something happened think about the companies who are dependent on china for the products for manufacturing of the chips for vehicles for softwares whatever then they have to face the consequences uh, they have to pay the heavy losses that cannot be afforded by much of the companies some of the companies might afford but most of the companies they won't so that is the reason uh you do zero covid strict rules in china still today nowadays the bf7 omicron variant is getting into action and thousands and lakhs of people are dying 
thousands and lakhs of cases are coming every day in china the situation is just horrendous it's pathetic it's uh, brutal i would say and because of that the supply chain has been disrupted their lockdown the the industries are not working the production is not at its peak and due to this the world the companies they are facing difficulties because they are not getting the material from the china because of these reasons the companies they want to switch to other countries like india and neighboring countries and this makes a golden opportunity for india to get into the market and show its potential to the world that we have the investment we have the huge talent of youngsters we have the most english speaking nation with multi talented skills we have all the resources we have the land we have political stability we have everything just trust on us gives the investments set up the factories and we know how to run it and we know how to make profit for you so because of that still various uh, companies are coming because of the pli production line scheme like apple samsung foxconn and that is a good sign still it's early investments are coming everything is fine we need to develop more infrastructure more technology and attract more investors more companies from other Uh, the country so that india will also become a production hub like china it would take time but still we have a opportunity because many of the company they are adopting this china plus one policy okay with that note this is my video this is a topic sashank lal signing off see you tomorrow with another video speak daily till that time hari krishna love you and bye bye